Hi, welcome back to my channel. Um, I'm sorry that the lighting is not perfect, but I can't be bothered to use the lighting by me. Um, like, I just feel like it's bright enough. Um, hold on. So, um, I wanted to do a video where I always feel like things come back round um, in life. Where I'm not that old, I'm only 23, but I have seen this in my past. And I, they say um, in childhood and adulthood, like, don't get me wrong, I'm a huge advocate of life gets easier. And it does, to be fair. The body stops changing and you grow up and you and life does get, like, more smooth um, for anyone that's young watching this. Um if anyone actually wants to watch this this may be but I don't really care I just want to put it out um so I watched a video just now which gave me inspiration for this um and like it's so cliche and I'm gonna try not to cringe myself out but at the same time um I do believe this deeply and I'm even like saying this to myself and I did a recent video about Jessie J's album which has some great moral standpoints in it but like the main point of this is like there's only one of you and to be authentic and remember to be authentic because I was watching Elevation Church and the fact is everyone does like lie about themselves and like change themselves for other people everyone does that throughout life be that in a relationship or at school when you want to get in with a certain group and stuff you know and the fact is everyone does it at any stage of life and but I do think God puts us through our trials and like takes us in different places and with different people to learn different stuff and different life lessons um and like overcome certain challenges and you know overcome yourself a bit like and stuff like that in certain situations because you might have an issue with something about yourself or someone else and then you learn from that situation the right way to go about it if that makes sense I don't want to get too like wordy but I think even though my perspective has expanded it's the point of it has stayed the same where like like there's been so much talk as well about narcissism recently and like people being like overly like narcissistic and stuff um, and it's so demonised and in the one hand I get it, narcissistic abuse is a real thing and um, people can um, be attacked for their um, narcissistic, no, people can attack because of their narcissistic tendencies but I've also heard that if you allow, after experiencing narcissistic abuse, the build up of sort of self-righteousness that can come with like the like the way that YouTube and certain people on on like the internet have described overcoming narcissistic abuse don't get me wrong I can't actually fault it in many ways because um it's really been helpful for me but they also do say you can become a narcissist yourself if you start to basically use their abuse and their de degradation to build yourself up higher where in one hand that's a good thing because it stops you from being pushed down but you don't want to go the other way like the point is to stay human and but like the fact is like everyone will like go through different stuff to make them like in different places but I'm not trying to like discount life and say I have the answers to everything in life like this is such a like discussion general video but it just it creates an expansive mindset when you go through these scenarios because I've definitely been more and less narcissistic at times anyway so everyone has that fa those phases which is fine um but I'm starting to remember and just come back around again in life to realize that like life is not about pleasing other people it's not even about pleasing yourself all the time sometimes it's about pleasing other people sometimes it's about pleasing yourself sometimes it's just about having and finding your own bliss and like where you need to be at that time and sometimes life gets difficult and sometimes life is easy and sometimes it's neither and it's just very boring and whatever but 
Um, I just think my message is to remember that narcissistic abuse is a thing um, and to always validate that. So I've done enough videos about narcissism so I'm not going to talk about that now but the fact is we have a right to safety, a God-given right I believe, to safety, happiness, joy, love, forgiveness and strength and purpose even and none of that can come from any, it can come from other people through God because I believe, because like they were talking about in Revelation Church that God gives us everything in his hand and if like things fall through his hand it comes through, so God will save, so there's like bad shit coming, here's you, there's God and there's bad shit coming in on you, God will put his hand on you and save you from lots of crap from getting run over by a bus today or a man to go mental and come and attack you um okay i don't like the word mental because mental health is an extremely serious topic so okay let's just say it stops bad things coming into your life okay i take back that man going mental and coming to attack you because that is literally a, such a bad thing to say and i don't that doesn't make any sense anyway like that doesn't happen we're all we've all got purpose god puts his hand on you i believe and like you know saves you from from bad things happening to you or bad stuff you doing bad stuff and whatever but anything that is bad that you would consider difficult or whatever it's coming through god's hands um and like it's not to say that god did it to you but he allowed it to happen to you for a purpose and like it's just remembering that like you have rights and no one can take them away from you and just try to work towards what you want to do and what you feel is right so yeah i'm gonna stop rambling because i will ramble for ages um and like literally this is like my videos into like one like video <laughs> Um, but yeah, it's a bit more of a mature way than I would have described it 10 years ago, but it's still the same point It comes back round for anyone that needs to hear it. Um, and yeah, okay, thanks for listening, bye.